Hi, my name is Greg and I'm a unicyclist. In this video, I'd like to share with you the method I've developed to mount a six foot tall unicycle, also known as a giraffe. First thing, I assume you could ride a unicycle. But secondly, it's really important that you're comfortable riding around on your giraffe before you attempt to free mount it. Before we get into the details, let's just watch one successful attempt. Once you get past the height factor, it's actually easier to ride a six foot unicycle. It's physics. And the dismount, easy. For me, the first step is placing my non-dominant foot on the tire, placing the pedals at 5 o'clock and 11 o'clock, and snapping my dominant foot to that 5 o'clock pedal. The rest will watch in slow motion. Once you get that dominant foot on that 5 o'clock pedal, there's two more important steps. Extending that leg fully so you can get up in the seat, and planting that other foot on the 11 o'clock pedal. Stabilize yourself, lean forward, and start to pedal. Success! Let's watch a couple more examples. It's important to keep your center of mass over the axle and you can see how the unicycle leans forward as I continue to climb up until I get to the top of the unicycle and then we're back straight above that axle. Let's be honest, when you're trying to learn to free mount a giraffe, there are a lot of failed attempts. In this example, I failed to get that second foot onto the pedal. This is a failure to fully extend my dominant leg and get on the seat. Here we're on, but leaning too far to the left. You see it happen again. And then I try to correct for that. And end up falling to the right. And this last one I'm excited and I start leaning forward and just fall right off the front. Learning to free mount a giraffe, it takes a lot of practice. But the result is very gratifying. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to learn more about me, visit gregcaster.com.